Professor, if you can humor me one last time, who was the absolutely the worst Roman emperor? <laughs> <laughs> and and why? <laughs> Please humor me. Let's end on this note. <laughs> such a, that's such a great question. Uh, Thank you. Who do I think is the worst? Um, like absolutely, just a complete mess from start to finish. Uh, yes, that's. Uh, I think whoever comes to mind. I think sadly, although I quite like him. Um, in some way, interesting start. The uh, the Emperor Julian of the fourth century. Okay, is... is that the guy who was killed by the Persians? Yes. No. Yes, it is. It, it was. He was killed okay. by the Persians. Wow. But he's the guy who tries to turn the Christian Empire back into the pagan pagan empire, um, and he tries to uh, turn the whole of the non Christian world into a kind of a mirror image pagan church, which had never been, you know, all the non-Christian cults were separate cults and they all did different things and whatever. And he tries to make well, everyone that, think... That sounds pretty good. Yeah, no, I mean, it was... Uh, uh, but he's he's the idiot who goes into battle at the end uh, having forgot forgotten to put his armor on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, okay. Yeah. Okay. Thus I can understand his, why you chose. That's bringing this his dude, short-lived yeah. attempt to uh, repaganize the empire uh, to a shuddering halt as he gets a spear through the through the chest. You know, Darwinism at work. Yes. And and okay. You know, if you read his works, he really is a bit of an idiot. You know, poor fella. <laughs> You might say he's a bit unlucky in that so much of his writing survived, so you can read about him a lot. But uh... <laughs> I think I will do just that yeah, before he, bed he, tonight. He kind of to cheer myself kind of, up. Um, first year undergraduate approach to historical analysis, you might say, uh, and sufficient power to act on it. And it's the combination of the two that makes him, um, in the end, so utterly. Reminds me of myself, to be honest. <laughs> um, thank you so much for listening. If you enjoyed what you heard, please consider subscribing and following Smart Cookies on YouTube, Apple Podcasts, and Spotify. And if you really liked what you heard, feel free to go on and become my benefactor on Patreon. So I'll be able to keep having these awesome conversations with really, really smart folks. Which brings me to my existing patrons, in effect producers of this podcast, a set of absolute legends without whom Smart Cookies would not exist in the first place. My immense gratitude goes to Micha Medved, Medinio, Gordon, Lorenzo, Mila, Veronica, Thea, Jurechuk, Goran, and Carmen. Your support means everything, so thank you.